Things seem to be going better for the Tampa Bay Rays tonight in Game 2 of the World Series. The Rays have been leading the whole game. They're up 6-3 to three now in the 8th inning, but it is a long series. And that said, the Rays are already planning ahead. Our Kevin Lewis shows us which pitcher could be key for the Rays once Game 3 rolls around. If you need someone to start a World Series Game 3 or any postseason game, Charlie Morton is a pretty good choice. The Rays' right-hander is 4-0 all-time in winner-take-all postseason games. Now, Game 3 isn't winner-take-all, but still the World Series. And the 36-year-old Morton, well, he's got that clutch gene, and he feels right at home when the pressure's on. I get in my routine, and I just feel, you know, like I feel normally, maybe a little more energy. There's more energy in the clubhouse. You, you study for a test. And you go into the classroom to take the test and nobody knows, even yourself, how you're going to perform in that test. Your teacher doesn't know, your classmates don't know, you don't know how you're going to perform in that test. And it's not until you take the test that everybody's figured it out. But you can go into that room and actually be ready for the test and be in the best position possible to, <laughs> to perform in the test. And I think that's, that's what sports and performance in general is all about. For Morton, playoff baseball isn't about the what or the where but the who. Playoff baseball is special to be a part of, um, but it's made special by who you can share it with. All the staff, uh, the staff families can come, other families can come. I looked up and there were, you know, Ranger fans here. There were people with Padres jerseys on and, you know, just people back in the stadium getting to experience baseball in person. The Thursday is an off day. Game three is Friday at Globe Life Field in Arlington, where Kyle Berger and I will have your weekend World Series coverage. In St. Pete, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.